going on guys steve here figured i'll do a little bit of an update video for you guys um i was live this morning nothing really going on i was cleaning having my coffee you know typical early morning stuff but uh yeah let's do a little update and uh i'll flip this around we'll go into the loft all right so here's all the youngsters they got the day off today it's gross outside it's um it's actually, it's actually cooler now than it was this morning when I got up. Uh, it was 78 this morning, like 90% humidity. Uh, just rained a little bit. And uh, it's just generally kind of a yucky day. So the birds are in. Not even law flying today. They did a lot this week. So we're just going to give them uh, a day to chill, hang out. And uh, tomorrow we'll pick right back up where we left off. So if you... Um, been following along the last week and change uh we started doing short tosses to get these birds flying because they didn't want to fly so we did a couple half mile tosses and that got them to go routing a couple times and which was uh big they needed to do that and then we just started moving um we did a mile a couple of times then went to two miles and then jumped up to four and a half and then yesterday we were at like five miles um, yesterday was an interesting toss, actually. i um, really proud of how the birds did, actually, considering um, I released them at the Costco here in town. It, well, not in my town. It's the next town over in Hazlitt. So we released in Costco, which is a nice, big, wide-open parking lot. And as soon as I let them out of the baskets, about 30 wild pigeons came off the roof of Costco right behind us. And my birds were heading straight home. And they made an abrupt right uh, left turn, and they came right back, and the two flocks mixed. It was uh, a little chaotic, and then then the flocks split in half. It was like half of my birds, and I'm sure some of the wild birds, well, about half of my birds figured out we're not supposed to stay here and started going home. And I'm sure they had some of the, the wild ones with them. And the other half, like, stayed over Costco. So I'm sure some of my birds were mixed in that. But um, uh, my birds came back a little chopped up. I had two birds were here when I got home, which was cool to see. They didn't waste any time. They just went home. And then I had about half of them come back, maybe a little more than half came back together. Uh, maybe about five minutes after I got home. And then uh, the rest, the majority of them kind of came in in groups of two or three uh over like the next 20 minutes and i had two that didn't come back until about 7 30 last night so they got really mixed up over there and who knows how far they flew but uh it also got hot yesterday so they definitely uh went down and and waited the heat out and then came home in the evening when it got a little cooler but they're doing pretty well i moved them pretty fast this week uh all things considered and uh, they've, they've been excelling. So we're just going to keep going. Like I said, today's the day off. It's a crummy, muggy day, so they can just chill. And tomorrow, I'm going to go back up that, that same direction, a uh, little past that. Uh, it's going to be about six miles. We'll do a toss there, six miles. And um, then Monday, hopefully the weather, weather permitting, hopefully Monday we can get up to... Uh, about that nine and a half, ten mile range, which is where I wanted to get them to this week, uh, about ten miles, and then uh, then we can start, um, you know, working our way up to 20, 30, 40, 50 miles, and uh, then just start repeating at that 50 mile range and have them ready for the first race. But we're uh, we're like right on schedule, so we weren't on schedule. We were uh, very behind schedule, but. I got them, got them moving quick this week, and that's that's more to do with them than me. Um, I said in the videos that I, you know they're not dumb birds. Look at this guy. Where are you going? Get back in your section, pal. Come on, come on. Thank you. That's my big, uh, my big Wolverine right there coming to check out the young birds. Stay there. But yeah, so they did good. Just wanted to update you guys and. Uh, I'll have a little montage with uh, all the releases and the birds flying and doing well. 
But uh, yeah, testament to them. They did really good. They had to use their heads this week. Get back in. And they uh, they did it. So we have not, uh, knock on wood again, aside from the one the hawk got, I still have not lost a bird. And I was, like I told you guys earlier, I was pretty positive I was going to lose some with how, uh, how stubborn they were being and how lazy. But uh, they're coming back. They're all coming back. So they definitely are, they're definitely smart birds. And now they're fighting. Boys being boys. And now you're trying to escape. Get back in. But all right, everybody. Uh, enjoy the little uh, montage after this. And maybe I'll do a video. Uh, probably not tomorrow. But if I get up to 10 miles on Monday, I'll do a video out of that. But all right. Take it easy. Enjoy the clip at the end.